In this video, we're going to look at adding shuttle radar topography mission data to QGIS. I'll include a link to this page so you can read more about SRTM data and the technology behind it. But this website actually allows you to go all around the world and find this 30 meter resolution data. It does obviously have some holes, particularly towards the poles, but this provides really great data for the vast majority of the planet. So zoom in to select an area to download, click on it, and then click Download DEM. Now, of course, if you're not logged in to the Earth Data Login Portal, you're not going to be able to download this data. And so I'll go ahead and include a link to this as well. You basically just need to make sure you're logged in. You can see I already was. And now we can open this extract the data, and then we'll be able to use it in QGIS. Okay, we've got QGIS open here, so we can go ahead and navigate to the area where we downloaded that data. And here we have a .hgt file, so if we double click, that will be added immediately to QGIS. And we can see this looks like elevation data. Of course, we may want to change how that is symbolized. We can do that very quickly here by choosing a color ramp. We can also choose some other ones that come preloaded with QGIS such as an elevation data set. And if you don't like these colors, you can obviously choose something else. Also choose Hillshade. And this becomes very recognizably elevation data. Um, a great way to add really useful data to QGIS and a quick way to select that data from pretty much anywhere on the planet.